Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to show you some neat tricks that you can do with NFC and NFC tasks on your phone. For those of you who don't know, NFC stands for Near Field Communication, and it's a wireless technology that allows phones to communicate with other devices or tags in close proximity. In my previous video, I showed you how to make a smart business card, but now I'm gonna show you that you can do way more than just that with NFC. One of the most common uses for NFC is to quickly share data or connect to a device. For example, you can use NFC to pair your phone with a Bluetooth speaker or even transfer files between two devices. But you can also use it to actually automate tasks on your phone. There are many apps available that allow you to create NFC tasks or actions which are triggered when you tap your phone against an NFC tag. These tasks can be simple or complex and can save you a lot of time by automating repetitive actions. On Android, you have NFC Tasks app. Uh, you can also use an app called Tasker, but I think you might have to pay for that one, but both can be found on the Play Store. For iPhone, you have an app called Launch Center Pro, which will serve the same purpose. So for example, you could set up a home tag that when scanned will put your phone onto vibrate, connect to your home Wi-Fi, and then open up your home automation app to automatically turn the lights on, you know, if, if you're lucky enough to have one of those. You could also maybe put one in your car that when scanned sets your destination automatically, turns your music app on, and then sends a message to your family to say, hey, I'm on the way home. You know, all these tasks can be automated. You don't even have to do any of that, just tap the tag. I know I personally found tags quite useful for setting timers and frequent reminders. I know at the gym, I only have an hour and a half free parking before I need to pay. So in my car, I have a tag that when tapped, sets a timer for that exact time. As I get out, I tap the tag and I walk away knowing that I didn't forget to set any of my timers. Keeping track of how much water you drink could also be important to you. Putting a small tag on the water bottle every time you refill it, you tap the tag and it will open up your health app and add the exact amount that you just drank. This is a really good way to keep track of how much water you've been drinking throughout the day. If you're a digital nomad who works from cafes, uh, you might want to put a tag on top of your laptop that when you tap it will turn your mobile hotspot on and off. Maybe you don't have a very good memory and you could add a tag to things that you need to remember to refill, such as the water container we just spoke about, or even on the bottom of a medication bottle. So when you tap it, it might open up a pharmaceutical company's website that will remind you to reorder your medication. If you live in a gated estate and you have one of the systems where you have to phone the gate in order to open, instead of phoning it, you could actually just add the phone number to a tag and then tap your phone against that tag in the car and the phone will automatically dial the gate. That way when you drive up to the driveway, you tap your phone and the gate should automatically open. You know, honestly, we could have made this like a 20 minute video of all the tasks that you could do with NFC. Like it's absolutely endless. Maybe you're already automating tasks. Maybe you want to do some type of tasks that need to be automated. Please leave it in the comment section below. And I'd love to see and share with you guys some ideas about things you could do with NFC. All right, there you have it. Those are some neat tricks you can do with NFC and NFC tasks on your phone. If you haven't already tried NFC technology, I highly recommend it because it could really help simplify your day-to-day -day life. Um, these tags are not very expensive, so it could really help. That's all from me for now. If you enjoyed this video, please follow me on Twitter or YouTube or subscribe because it really helps out the channel. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video. Cheers.